In the very heart of the Indian subcontinent lies Bihar. A realm esteemed not merely for its storied antiquity, but also for the breathtaking spectacle of its natural grandeur. This idyllic terrain unravels before us like an artful masterpiece. Enchanting connoisseurs of nature with its undulating emerald fields and serene aquatic realms. Bihar extends a compelling invitation to wanderers, encouraging them to surrender to the untarnished allure of its lush woodlands, shimmering lakes and gracefully rolling hills. Bihar's law extends beyond its historical epochs, gracefully weaving through the untouched grandeur of its natural surroundings. Each hill, every lake and the whispering forests narrate tales of timeless beauty. Embark with us on a journey to unveil Bihar's concealed treasures, where nature's elegance takes center stage and the landscapes echo with the whispers of history. Step into a realm where discovery knows no bounds. Welcome to Bihar's Nature Symphony, unveiling the beauty of Bihar. Rajkir Bestowed with the profound moniker, the City of Kings graces the district of Nalanda in Bihar. It stands as a living testament to the epoch's past, having served as the venerable seat and capital for dynasties like Gupta, Haryanka, Brihadratha and the illustrious Mauryan Empire. Amidst its ancient embrace, Rajgir reverberates with the echoes of historical luminaries, hosting iconic figures such as the Buddha and the Mahavir within its hallowed grounds. Approximately 100 kilometers from capital Patna, Rajgir is very well connected by roads and rails. In the picturesque landscapes of Rajgir, the enchanting Ghora Katora Lake emerges as a true jewel in the crown of beautiful Bihar. According to local legends, the origin of the name of this area can be traced back to the era of King Jarasandh. It is believed that the location was once home to the royal horse stable where King Jarasandh and his army prepared for battles. The historical significance of this place led to its distinctive name Ghora Katura Lake. This eco-friendly haven is accessible only by e-vehicles, horse carts or bicycles. Ensuring nature's tranquility remains undisturbed. At its heart, a majestic 70-foot-tall Buddha statue stands as a regal guardian, casting a serene aura across the tranquil waters. Embarking on a boat voyage around this towering symbol of tranquility promises visitors a unique and unforgettable experience. यहाँ पे मुझे आकर वो जो चीज़ बहुत अच्छी लगी वो इको फ्रेंडली यहाँ पे जो ये टूरिस्ट साइट है जैसा हम देखते हैं बाकी जगहों पे डायरेक्टली हम गाड़ी से चले जाते हैं और वहाँ पे पोल्यूशन एंड ऑल हम फैलाते हैं बट इस जगह पे एक ब्यूटी ये है कि आप यहाँ पे आराम से आइए और उसके बाद आपको ई रिक्शा यहाँ पर मिल जाता फिर आपको यहाँ पर आना है घोरा कटोरा लेक बिकम्स अ सेंचुरी ऑफ पीस एंड रिफ्लेक्शन अडोन विद घोरा कटोरा इको पार्क The Ghora Katora Eco Park 
is a serene oasis where every glance unveils a lush tapestry of greenery. Inspired by Bud's profound life lessons, the park becomes more than just a place. It becomes a beacon, urging visitors to transcend their limits and aspire for greater heights. Bihar Tourism, I am very happy to be here, which has maintained it well in this place. In this place, there are Embarking on our expedition, we venture into the captivating Rajgir Zoo Safari, an avant-garde sanctuary, sprawling across an extensive 480 acres. This modern zoological marvel revolutionizes our interaction with wildlife by allowing animals to roam freely providing an intimate window into their natural habitats, framed against the grandeur of Ratnagiri and Swarnagiri hills. The safari vehicles within the zoo safari boast larger windows compared to those used in other parks, offering visitors an exceptional panoramic view. Amidst this vast landscape, the presence of white tigers introduces visitors to a breathtaking spectacle elevating the safari into a truly awe-inspiring experience. This sanctuary is a heaven for a diverse array of wildlife, including majestic elephants, panthers, leopards, lesser cats, wild dogs, barking deers and pygmy dogs. As we delve into the heart of this expansive sanctuary, the rich biodiversity unfolds, inviting us to witness the harmonious dance of nature and wildlife in a setting that transcends conventional zoo experiences. Setting foot on the Rajgir Nature Safari, adventurers encounter a myriad of exhilarating pursuits, from adrenaline pumping zip lines and zip biking to the maneuver of archery and shooting. Crossing the suspension bridge on foot unveils a unique perspective, allowing immersion in the pristine natural ambience. This journey transcends mere recreation, evolving into a therapeutic escape, where passionate nature enthusiasts find solace in the untouched beauty that surrounds them. Amidst the lush valleys, another marvel awaits, the Kachua Pahar or the Turtle Hill. A symphony of geological marvels, this hill echoes the silhouette of a majestic turtle. Beyond its visual allure, Kachua Pahar stands as a testament to the harmonious interplay between nature and time. Merely a stone's throw away from the Rajgir Nature Safari unfolds the marvel of modern architecture, the Rajgir Glass Bridge. It unfolds as a harmonious fusion of nature's allure and architectural brilliance. This 85-foot-long, 6-foot-wide marvel made its debut in 2021. Nestled among five hills, the bridge meanders through luxuriant pathways embraced by towering trees. With its transparent floor, it offers an exhilarating perspective, a unique vantage point that invites you to marvel at the world below. This is a height. I was scared starting, but now I am feeling much better. It's a very romantic place. I am enjoying it here. The Rajgir Glass Bridge, a testament to human ingenuity, offers not just a thrilling experience, but also a profound connection with nature. In proximity to this remarkable man-made marvel unfolds the splendor of nature, a vibrant realm known as Pandu Pukhar and the adjacent Eco Huts. Mm -hmm. 
encompassing an expansive 22 acres, this locale unfolds its legacy, rooted in the Mahabharata era, resonating with the tales of the illustrious King Pandu. King Pandu, the father of the Pandavas, is recounted to have besieged Rajgrihe, transforming it into a horse stable. Upon his departure, a depression, now known as a swale, emerged, collecting rainwater and giving rise to the historically significant Pandu Pukhar. Against this historical backdrop, the commanding statue of King Pandu takes center stage, complemented by the exhilarating traverse of the Burma Bridge and an array of sports activities at Pandu Pukhar. Here, the fusion of history and adventure beckons tourists, promising an immersive and exhilarating escapade etched in the narrative of unforgettable moments. As our quest transcends physical boundaries, we encounter the allure of Nalanda, the world's inaugural residential university generously founded by Emperor Kumara Gupta in 427 CE and nurtured by the dedication of erudite monks and teachers for over eight centuries until its culmination in the 12th century CE. Boasting 2,000 teachers and 10,000 students, Nalanda beckoned scholars from far-reaching corners like China, Korea, Japan, Tibet, Mongolia, Sri Lanka and Southeast Asia. These scholars, hailing from diverse lands, have chronicled the atmosphere, architectural splendor, and the profound wisdom imparted by the esteemed educators of Nalanda. Nalanda encompassed a diverse curriculum that covered a wide spectrum of subjects, including grammar, logic, theology, astronomy, metaphysics, medicine, and philosophy. Among them, the meticulous records left by Chinese scholars, particularly the renowned Sang Shan, stand out. As he carried back a multitude of scriptures that were subsequently translated into Chinese. In the year 1200 CE, Bihar witnessed the conquest of Bakhtiar Khilji, who in a devastating incursion subjugated the renowned centers of learning, Udantapuri, Vikramashila and Nalanda University. Legend has it that following the massacre of innumerable scholars and students at Nalanda, Bakhtiar Khilji commanded the configuration of the three colossal libraries. These repositories, spanning over nine floors of the majestic edifice, housed myriad scriptures encompassing diverse subjects. The inferno raged for more than six months resulting in the obliteration of the entire Nalanda University, consigned to the chronicles of history, lost in the sands of time. Approximately six centuries post the decline of Nalanda, the eminent site caught the attention of Sir Francis Buchanan, who documented its existence. Subsequently, the Archaeological Survey of India meticulously excavated and stabilized the site initiating the process from 1915 to 1937 and later recommencing efforts from 1974 to 1982. As we wander through these sprawling ruins, we are transported back to a time when Nalanda was a beacon of intellectual pursuit. Its vast expanse housed libraries, lecture halls, and meditation chambers, fostering a holistic environment for learning. Within these walls were stored a treasure trove of ancient manuscripts, documenting knowledge in fields from astronomy to medicine. As the sun sets over these ancient ruins, let us pause to appreciate the enduring legacy of Nalanda University. Its stones may weather, but its spirit lives on, resonating through the corridors of history.
transitioning from historic sites, we venture into the marvels of the modern age, the Karamchat Dam, nestled in Rohtas district. Approximately 35 kilometers from Sasaram, this reservoir stands as a favored destination for tourists. The panoramic vistas during sunrise and sunset unfold a captivating spectacle. The dam, with a height of 46.3 meters and a length of 1,615.40 meters, epitomizes both engineering prowess and natural splendor. Enfolded within the embrace of verdant hills and lush forests, Karam Chat Dam is cradled by the Durgavati River, whose origins trace back to the Kemur Hills within the Kemur and Rohtas Forest Division. The mesmerizing panorama of the Karam Chat Dam is truly spellbinding, with its elevated hill backdrop offering vistas that are nothing short of awe-inspiring. Flanked by verdant foliage, the shimmering waters of the dam gleam like molten silver, casting a serene spell on every beholder. The gentle ripples of the water play host to graceful ducks and other avian visitors, adding a touch of natural poetry to the tranquil setting. Visitors find solace and rejuvenation here, whether it's through a leisurely boat ride that lets them soak in the pristine beauty of the surroundings or simply by immersing themselves in the palpable peace that envelops the area. With the towering hill majestically framing the scene, the Karamchat Dam offers an unforgettable rendezvous with unspoiled nature. Merely an hour and a half away from Karamchat Dam, awaits a captivating natural spectacle in the form of a mesmerizing waterfall known as Telharkund Waterfall. This natural wonder and its surroundings offer breathtaking panoramic vistas, creating an idyllic setting for picnics and tourism. The cascading water replenishes the serene lake below, inviting visitors to immerse in its rejuvenating embrace. The gushing waterfall culminates in the serene Telharkund Lake, nestled at its base, creating an enticing destination for tourists seeking to indulge in a refreshing dip. This profound cascade is a captivating sight, distinguished among Bihar's waterfalls, drawing enthusiasts enchanted by its panoramic allure. Embarking on a voyage from the awe-inspiring waterfall, our journey leads us to the serene haven of Gridhkud Hill in Rajgir. An age-old sanctuary reverberating with the sacred echoes of the Buddha's Lotus Sermon. True to its name, Vulture Peak, the summit mimics a vulture's head in a natural stone formation, embodying a spiritual haven. Referred to as Gujhakut in Buddhist texts, this sacred site once a favoured spot where Lord Buddha disseminated his teachings, exudes an untouched spiritual power, untouched by human grandeur. This sacred space serves as a haven where the pursuit of peace and escape from the worldly clamour find fulfilment. As one ascends the hill, a sacred cave comes into view a hallowed space where ancient legends tell of Lord Buddha's meditation. Today, this cave is a sanctuary adorned by pilgrims who bathed in the gentle glow of burning candles, evoke a profound spiritual ambience. 
The enduring presence of Lord Bud resonates within, creating a timeless connection that continues to be felt to this day. From the profound recesses of age-old caverns to the meandering paths of customs, Bihar's manifold terrains and opulent legacy proffer an irresistible summon. Venturing into this kaleidoscopic realm entreats wanderers to undertake a riveting odyssey of revelations and marvels, wherein every stride unfurls a rich fabric interwoven with the strands of antiquity, transcendence, spiritualism, and the unbridled splendor of the natural world. As the resonance of bygone eras converges with the vitality of the present, Vihar stands as a tribute to the enduring charm of exploration and the ageless narratives etched upon its soil.